Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your Slack account and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you delete or remove an app from your Slack workspace? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to delete or remove an app from your Slack workspace anyway? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running a free account, like I am, you know, that you can have a maximum of 10 apps. So maybe you want to go ahead and delete a few to free up some space. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your Slack workspace. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well. But I've already logged into my Slack account and this is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to go ahead and delete or remove an app, first you need to make sure you're working in the correct workspace. So click right here and you're going to see a drop down and then just choose the correct workspace. I just have one. Once you've chosen the correct workspace in order to go ahead and remove or delete an app down here on this left bar, make sure this is opened up to apps and you should be able to see all of the apps that you have inside of your Slack account. So next, you just want to choose the app that you want to remove from your Slack workspace. So for example, I'll go ahead and, and choose this one. Okay. So if you happen to find the blog from Slack, for some reason, that's not updated, they said to go into the Slack apps, but it wasn't showing up. So what you need to do is do exactly as I did, just click on it. And then once you see that, you're going to see this button here, configuration. So for some reason, some of the apps are actually positioned a little differently. So when you click on Google sheet, the configuration button is right there, but let's say maybe we're going to click on Asana. Okay. So here's Asana. You can see there's no configuration button. So what you need to do is look up here to the top and then click on about. Okay. Once you click on about, you're going to see the configuration button. That's where you need to be in order to remove or delete an app. So let's go ahead and just delete Asana. So we're going to click on configuration. Okay. So once you click on the app configuration, it's going to bring you here. You have these options, description feature, make sure that configuration is clicked on. And then you're just going to scroll to the bottom and then you should see the section here, remove app, click on remove app. Okay. You get this warning saying that it's going to revoke all permissions and authorizations for this app. If you're okay with that, click on remove app. Okay. Now it refreshes. Now you're going to see this green button add to Slack. And then if we go back here to our Slack workspace, okay, here on the left side, you can see the app has now been removed from my Slack workspace. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to delete or remove an app in your Slack workspace, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.